Yo, what is going on, homies? It's your boy Stumped back from the OPTC video. In today's video, we're diving back into the Worldwide Celebration banners with a couple of multis on part two of the Blackbeard part. Now, I've done a few more multis off camera. I will release them hopefully before this, if not. But in today's video, we're hoping to pick up a particular character, not only by the name of Blackbeard, but also by the name of Shanks. Now, with the Anniversary Shanks banner, I did go fairly deep trying to rainbow the unit just because it is a Shanks character. So hopefully today we can actually pick up a couple of dupes for our Shanks. Um, but look, at the end of the day, any of these Anniversary characters are missing. So if I pull any of them, I'm going to be pretty happy. So we're not going to go too crazy. We're only going to do like a couple multis. We might lock it at three. We might go a little bit further. But um, if you guys are still summoning, best of luck. And I wish you guys all of the luck for your multis if you guys are still summoning. Because look, there will be more parts to this anniversary or worldwide anniversary. So just be mindful of that. Um, if you do manage to get the units, maybe just call it a day there. Um, unless you're willing to sort of burn through your gems and sort of say sayonara. Um, I wouldn't go too nuts like you're seeing here, but hey, I figured if I'm going to summon, I and I got the opportunity to, I'm going to record it, because just summoning without recordings is just silly stuff nowadays, if I'm completely honest. So, big downside to part two and part three is that they have very, very bad steps, like incredibly bad steps, like they're just, they're not, not ideal. Um, I don't know what they were thinking, making part one steps so crazy, and then restricting part two and part three um i did make a youtube post saying that i'm not going to chase regular legends um so moving forward i'm probably just not going to do that that doesn't mean i'm not going to summon for them uh it just means that i'm not going to go crazy on their banners oh i was hoping for the cut in there show me a shanks killer i think i oh i don't even know if i can use killer uh vasco shot but yeah i'm not going to go crazy on their banners because anything that you can pull from a ticket by law of big numbers, will eventually turn up on your account anyway. So that's like my logic behind not summoning for um, regular batch legends. And Burgess being a non-anniversary exclusive... Okay, no, nothing there. Not being anniversary exclusive means that eventually, over time, he's going to pop up on another banner. He's going to pop up in the tickets, and we can definitely pull him there. However, what Bandai has had a tendency to do is not include the Legends of New on these new banners, which is a little bit of a downside. If you guys are looking for stuff, I'll take that. That'll take. That'll take. My first ever dupe of this particular character. So that's a Final Tap tablet for Luffy. Very nice stuff. Uh, like I said, any of the anniversary exclusives are welcomed over here. So that's always fun. Um... Unlike part one, where like Kdat and Waifu, I was like, no, 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 no. Even like Ace, I'm like, no, 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 no. Okay, big mom. Yeah, that's not ideal. Um, but yeah, what I was saying was, is that like stuff like Momo and Hiyori still aren't on any banner. Like, unless you're counting like part one, where it's like every single legend, Momo and Hiyori just, they, they're just, they're not, they're nowhere to be found. Like at all. So... It's very strange that they're doing that. I don't like it. I think it's really bad design. I think it's going to piss off a lot of players. And I guess we'll have to wait and see for um, stuff like Lilith and stuff like Bonnie if that trend continues. Uh, obviously, Bonnie and Lilith aren't on this particular banner. And look, I don't think that like not dropping them directly after their banner is a bad move. I think that's okay. But like Momo and Hiyori came out like the month before New Year's. So, like, I don't understand how we are, like, almost in March and we still don't have Momo Hiyori on any banner. Like, it's wild to me. Absolutely wild. As for these multis, these multis have been garbage since that Luffy pull. Like, absolutely garbage. People say pull on part two, pull on part three because you have a higher chance of pulling the legend you're searching for. Well, look, at the end of the day, we play an R game of RNG and RNG has a tendency to favor the brave. However, it also has a tendency to leave you flat on your ass. So just be mindful of that. Um, cool. This is going to be the last of my summons for the Worldwide Celebration Part 1, Blackbeard Part 1. 
Uh, I just think continuing after this is just... It's just... It's not smart. Um, honestly, it's probably not smart even coming this far. But at the end of the day, we make some content. Wow! That's nuts. I don't even care about the hockey. Screw your hockey. Okay. Maybe there's a red here. Maybe. Is that... 12.5% red rate, by the way. Like, where the red? Like, where are the reds? Oh, there's the red. Okay, I was hoping for the cut in there, but that's fine. Talk about Momo, man. I actually think my Momo's 150. Like, I don't even think I can use that. It's not ideal. But look, it is what it is. It is what it is. Okay, there- was this a guaranteed red? Righto. Cool. Brother, we're never- we're just never gonna rainbow our shanks. Like, it's just- nah, it wasn't a guaranteed red. It was a rate boosted or legend. I think we're gonna go to 10, and then we're definitely calling it a day there. Red hockey? Nope. We're getting a red, though! There's the red stump! You asked for the red! Look like such a, um... Such a dropkick with my sty. That's why I haven't been doing face cams lately. Because I've got, like... You can kind of see it with my bung eye. Um, it's not, it hasn't been a fun time. A lot of facial swelling. Still no red along the way, though. Like, we, we make jokes, but, like, it's just rare recruits. We're not even pulling the batch. Like, bro, I'm so glad I summoned on part one. Holy shit. Wow, Sabo Koala in 2024? This unit's actually, like, almost due for a um, 6+, plus, which is kind of nuts. Um, Luffy Lore as well. My sweet brother in Christ. Are we are we just not pulling? Today was just not this is not the part to pull, apparently. No reds. No reds. This is where OPIC Oh look, we got a rare recruit, guys. We got a rare recruit. Doc Q. Nice. Bro, if these were my actual summons, I would be flipping tables right now. Like, I would actually be flipping tables. That's like the fourth multi I think we've had with no reds. Not a single legend in sight. That is bonkers to me. Okay, we're getting a red here, thank God. But like, 12.5% red rate. Like, ideally we should be counting the reds per multi. Not being like, oh, we're going to get a red. Still, like, okay, cool. Thank you. Oh my God. Choppa. Robin and Law. It's ironic too, because they've made Robin and Law like rate boosted on so many banners, and yet they haven't put Momo and Hiori back. Alright, well, like, can you please give me some anniversary? It's good. Oh. Um. Well. These multis were really bad until this point. Like, really, really bad until this point. That was unexpected. Um, like I said, hopefully I release the other multis. But that is the final copy of my Blackbeard. That is a rainbow Blackbeard. Kind of wild. I didn't ask for this. But I... I I didn't ask for this. We just we just got here. Um, yes, we're going to do the last multi because whilst there is a chance we pull another Blackbeard, there's also a chance we pull Shanks. There's also a chance we pull Luffy. So, I mean, you don't come nine multis far to get a limited pull step and just not do it. Like, it's unheard of in a stump vocabulary. All right, let's see. Let's see what we, what we can't get. Like I said, we've rainbowed Blackbeard now, which is awesome. Um, now we could just get more Momos, apparently. <sighs> Give me, besides, Bur oh, Secret Red. Besides Burgess, the Quick Momo is the only regular legend that I'm missing. So the fact that I keep getting Psy Momo, it's just like a bit of a, it's a bit of a slap to the face. And I'm kind of over it. I would like Shanks, please. Wrap it up with the Shanks. Douglas Bullet. Okay, last poster. Oh, this is going to be Blackbeard. Oh, it's not. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Shanks. Kid Luffy. I'll, I'll... I will take Kid Luffy. That is fine. That is all good. I would prefer Shanks. However, I'll take a Kid Luffy. But that is going to wrap up my part one Blackbeard multis. Hopefully, you guys had some luck. You managed to pick up Blackbeard. Maybe you picked up Burgess. 
Best of luck to you if you guys are still summoning. If you're chasing Kobe, if you're chasing whatever. Best of luck. And let me know what you guys pulled down below. Most importantly, belt the like button, hit the subscribe button, do all that good stuff. But most, most importantly, wherever you guys are in this beautiful world, please remember to enjoy the rest of your day. As those homies, thank you all for watching, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Later.